Good morning all. Yeah, it's roughly seven o'clock here in Havana. Uh, we made it. Put our bikes together pretty successfully. No major issues. We may have brought more than we thought we needed, but it's not always the case. And now it's time to get going, hit the road on our second annual trip to Cuba. You're kidding. That is not a lime, brah. Those are avocado. Oh, no, maybe not. No, that's not. That's passion fruit. Yeah, passion fruit. It's not right, though. Avocado. No, it's not. I thought it was. It looks like avocado. Okay, bye. Adios, bye -bye. gracias. Okay. Anyone have a map up? That's not a good map, though. But I mean, you need to get out. So we've got ten miles in the bag. Havana. 40 still to go. We already had a flat tire, but that's just par for the course. We should get some ice cream. This is a secondary road in Cuba and we decided to have an adventure so this is where we're going. I'm sure it's going to be followed up with many flat tires. So we stopped for lunch, had a great lunch in a tiny little town, and then decided we were going to take a slight detour from our original uh, route, but we missed a turn and said, ah, we'll be fine, and then made a turn, which was the only way back to our intended route, 
uh, via a very thin hiking path or Jeep road, if you want to call it. So basically that's what we're going down. And the kicker is that it is completely laden with these thorns everywhere. So I have become separated from our group and I'm afraid they might be back there with a flat tire. So I'm gonna go back and see if I can find them. So update is Gregory did have a flat. Unfortunately, it's his fifth one. He's been having some rear wheel issues. We're having some tube issues, some rim tape issues, all the things you don't want to be dealing with. He's gone through two tubes. We patched it a bunch of times. And here they come. Oh shit, Go right. Go right. Go right. So we are deep in the jungle. We have a vague idea where we are. Uh, these side roads are always an adventure. And part of us thinks this is silly, but then part of you is like, this is awesome, because that's what this is all about, an adventure. And uh, yeah, it's pretty amazing. Just cruising this trail. It's kind of hard to see, but there's some real pretty scenery. And I should probably focus on where I'm going instead of talking to the camera. And as soon as I put the camera away, I have now flatted. What fun. All right, here goes nothing. So after a successful flat repair, I caught my crew. We've come across this first signs of civilization. And Gregory, unfortunately, once again, has a slow leak. So we're making real slow progress. And now some commentary by Chris. Well, the ride started out of Havana at a blistering pace. The mechanic and the big Australian were out in the lead. Abuelita had a little bit of a problem. Things really slowed down in the jungle though. Now we're on the last 10 Ks coming into Las Terrazas. Should be a brutal end to the ride. It's about 1,200 feet of vertical they gotta do. The legs must be feeling like jello. They're gonna look to the farmer to bring home the bacon though. Let's get it done. Right lads, find it and grind it. Big Australian out front. Got some climbing to finish out the day. Here it comes. How you feeling, Shawnee? Feel great. Any words? Wisdom? No. Yeah. I'm good. Mom's the word? We made it to Villa Duke. Can I show you guys how this works? It's on a farm. I'm gonna do some walking around. We just had some fresh bananas right off the tree. There is all sorts of fresh fruit. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Yes. <laughs> what is this? Coffee? Coffee. Yeah. yeah. So we we had like 100 trees of this Back because this here. this one is robusta. This type of this coffee. Variety, yeah. Yeah. Oh, but we have also have this other variety. This is Arabica, so you can see okay. this one is coming. Yeah. We have bananas everywhere. So we have like a, the Robusta coffee. We have like a hundred. Look at all those bananas, coffee. so it's good. Over there, it's almost everywhere coffee. And we have for this one, the Robusta, no, the Arabica. We have like uh, 300 trees. So do you sell beans or just for yourself? No, it's, for the moment it's just for the family. For the farm, we don't really like the coffee and also the guests. They really love it. And this tree here? Okay, this is a Spanish name. I don't know the oh, translation okay. in English. Spanish name is Caimito. When it's ready, it's purple. Uh, cool. Yeah, my grandfather loved it. <laughs> but we can average like three, four hundred. So you can see. Yeah. What is it close to? Is it like an apple or a pear? No, it's completely different. It's really soft and really a lot of juice inside. And sweet. And sweet, yeah. yeah. But purple. Yeah. Purple. purple. Yeah. And you have What's it harvest? called? Ma uh, Caimito. Caimito. Spanish name. Sorry? How do you harvest them? The we can climb or we can just wait that they fall. Okay. Still so good if they fall. Remember the pigs? And we also have the bees over there. Okay. The pineapple fall, fall over there. Living off the land in Cuba. Can you raise them up here? Yes. When they get bigger? When, sure. when they get bigger? No, but <laughs> they don't stay up there. No, 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 we just take it down on the bottom. Okay. This is my, my uncle. Uh, so you gonna have to be in the street. Oh yeah. Yeah. More fruit trees. This is our little spot for the night. Just mount a bunch of bananas and our little abode. What are we doing, Oliver? We're doing 10 more before we go. On the count. On the count. Sean, are you ready? Yeah, you can do them on your knees for a little Alright, let's do a TikTok. TikTok. We're doing a TikTok. Do it. TikTok, here we go. This is how old man do push ups. Okay. Alright, everybody, here we go. Are you flaming it? Ready? Count it out. One. Good job. Good TikTok, boys. Good TikTok. You've got a bad one.